Okay, artists, you have six hours to tattoo a portrait. Only five of you remain, and four of you will move on. And your time starts now. All right. Let's do it. Get on it. You just stand straight up and just relax. With portraits, precision's essential because this is where everything has to be dead on. Every single drop of ink that you apply to that portrait is gonna be a reflection of the face in the picture and it can't be off. If you change a feature on a face, you're out. When I do a tattoo, I'm like, do this tattoo like you would be okay with walking around with it. My canvas originally wanted his wife's portrait on his arm and I talked him into moving it on his thigh. This is much better placement, but this tattoo has a lot of things going against me right now. The hair could totally make or break this tattoo. I need to make sure the hair is flowing, but not super crazy. And on top of everything, it is so stressful having this woman watch me tattoo her face. This is a ton of pressure right now. All right. At this point where we're at, I mean, it's very real. Get down to that final few, and there's just definitely more pressure. My canvas has the best reference photo of all of these. She has long, curly blonde hair and very distinctive features. I know I can really put her soul in this portrait. Thanks, Cruzman. You definitely gave me tattoo of the day. Four hours remaining. Four hours to go, everybody. I believe I'm the only one doing full color. Full color. Every You're going color. full color. One hundred percent. First tap, man. I gotta go all the way, right? That's what I hear. Man, this challenge is about active military guys. They're about to get deployed. I've been there where those kids are gonna go. I can imagine what my dad went through when I got deployed. A lot of people just don't understand what it's like to go do something traumatic. This is my day. Everything about this is all Chris Blinston. I was pretty shocked you got this. I was surprised he gave it to me. I was surprised he chose the one for himself he did. I wasn't the least amount of face. Good point. If you're Good not point. a portrait tattooer, then it's the least amount of portrait you have to do. It's a lot of frosting. A piece of shrapnel actually came while I cut my hair, just nicked my ear, just enough to make it bleed. Yeah. And it's like, you know, this thing just, you see your hair fall, it's like, that's close. You're talking about a split second difference. It would have taken my head off.